Hi, I'm Chris. Welcome to Tell You Later. What? We haven't got a title song for this show, so we're singing this thing instead. Okay. It's really just a substitute, nonetheless. The melody may stay in your head. Cause it's a tune. It's a tune. You'll love to croon. You'll love to croon. Ah, but there's one thing you should know. What's that? Well, Lee, uh, we have to confess we do not possess a title song for this show. Ain't it peculiar? Believe it or not, <laughs> we haven't got a title song for this show. Hey, we did it. Wow. Victory. Hi, folks. Now, this is unusual because that's the first time um, that, that, that the famous clip of us doing that song wasn't used. And that's because, <clears throat> because of May Day. May Day. May Day. May Day. Now, May Day means a number of things to people. Uh, it means help if you're out on a ship. Hello. Hi, sister. James here. Oh, sorry. I was looking for a May Day sound effect. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, don't do that because... Sorry. Because what's happening... I'm trying to stop this. What's happening on this episode is it's a tribute to the workers of the world. And since we only have a crew of one, it's our tribute to our crew of one. We gave the crew of one the day off. Yes. The crew of one has the day off and there will be no post-editing on this show. Everything is live as we're doing it right now. And because of that... You can't do pre-editing, can you? No, no, that's, that's like, a good point. I, think I was it would redundant. Be redundant. I was to completely say post redundant. Editing. I was redundant. Unless redundant. you were editing your mail. Perhaps yes. Postal. That's I postal will, editing. That's, I guess. But it's not different. going postal, which no. is a completely different, different thing. Different. Completely different. Right. 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 Okay. Hmm. So. so <laughs> I have these sound effects okay, on here. Okay. Okay. <laughs> right. Well, that's nice. But but. In order to get through without any editing, for example, that we would have cut out of the show, uh, any editing whatsoever, Katie has made a solemn vow that she will not open her mouth and interrupt me in any way during the show. Isn't that right? What if I have to cough? No, you could talk. You oh, could I talk. can talk now? Yeah. What if I have to cough or sneeze? Is that okay? That's allowed. You could aim over there and okay. do that because we're living in the time of pandemia. Mm. And... Um, so what we're doing, what I'd like to do, is talk a little bit about uh, labor and the history of May Day. Because May Day started in the United States of America as a day in honor of labor and all the workforces throughout the well, country. Well, why do they go, May Day, May Day, May Day? That's on because they're working? Yes, because they're working on a ship. Oh, okay. Right. Yeah. That makes sense. I, yes. And uh, so, but what happened was... Did I ever tell you that my... Oh, uh, uh, mm. remember... Mm -hmm. what, what happened was it began in the United States as a celebration of labor and spread throughout the world, where in many countries throughout the world it's celebrated to this day as a day in honor of labor. Hence, our crew of one has the day off. And there's no editing on this show. Yes, I think a little celebration is due to our crew of one. Now, Katie, you you can speak, but you don't. But you you solemnly swore not to interrupt. Can I talk now? Yeah, with your mouth. You said okay. you will not open your mouth and interrupt. Right, and I'm not. Gonna, but you know what? I have a friend who actually had a baby on Labor Day. <laughs> <laughs> that was very. Uh, uh, that, Teresa, that if you're watching, showed hi. a lot of foresight. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. we write a whole saga about that. Yeah, what would you call it? Labor Day. I was thinking of the Foresight Saga, but oh. <laughs> either, either one will about, do, I suppose. Yes? The Saga of Labor Day. <laughs> <laughs> and you could do I that, too. Could. I, I, I suppose you could. So, uh, yes, Katie. You could write a song about that. You could. Hey, let's do a work song right now. Do okay. you have a favorite work song? Yeah. Which, which is it? Working on the Railroad. Me too. Oh, by the way. There's a very controversial song in Texas right now because they took the words and changed them, and now people aren't sure they want to do it. Did you know that? Uh-uh. Yeah. No? So, Is that in celebration of Labor Day or something else? No, it's just, uh, they call it the Eyes of Texas. Now, when I was a kid, there was a show called, uh, that starred a character named Jace Pearson. <laughs> yes. Gasp. Gasp. 
um, Jace Pearson of the Texas Rangers. And, um, uh, and, and that show began, the, uh, let's see, these are tales of Texas Rangers, a band of sturdy men. And it went on. And So um, a band of, they, what instruments did they play? I, you know, I don't know because uh, w the clip showed one Texas Ranger, probably Jace Pearson, walking down the street, and then his sidekick, played by Harry Lauter with a T. Was it scary? I, I know. I, I don't know. I don't know if we own any rights to that piece of music either. Oh but, yeah, but, we do. Uh, we do. I okay. bought this. Oh, you did. Okay, good. Well, that that's good. There's, uh, that was showing foresight on your part. Yeah, because it's united with labor. I yes. think, okay. because, you know, we're working together here. Yes, we are. We are indeed. Mm -hmm. So uh, um, so anyway, but, but at, at the University of Texas at Austin, uh, some people took uh, issue with the, the fact that the, 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 their lyrics, the Eyes of Texas, were originally performed around 1913 or 1907 or something as part of a minstrel show, which is no longer in fashion, as you may know. Oh, but did they... And, and, <clears throat> Yes. Did they write it for the show, or they just used it in the show? Well, it's a rewrite of, uh, uh, yeah, yeah. I, I guess they did, yeah. Are we going to do the railroad song? Yes, we are. Okay. I've been waking on the railroad all the live long day. All day. Whew. I've been waking on the railroad. Why? Just to pass the time away? I guess so. Can't you hear the whistle blowing? Let me find a whistle. Rise up so oily in the morn. Ooh. Can't you hear the captain shouting? Die to blow your horn. A horn. Uh, Dino, won't you blow? Dino, won't you blow? Dino, won't you blow your horn? Dino, won't you blow? Dino, won't you blow? Dino, won't you blow your horn? Say, uh, someone's in the kitchen with Dinah. Someone's in the kitchen, I know. Oh, oh, oh. Someone's in the kitchen with Dinah. Strumming on the old ukulele. <laughs> fee, fi, a fiddly I O. A fee, fi, fiddly I O. Oh, 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 oh. Hey, that fee, sounds like Christmas. A fiddly I O. Strumming on the old banjo. Mm, plunk, plunk. Plunkety plunk, oh, plunkety plunk, that. plunk, plunkety plunk, 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 plunkety plunk, 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 plunkety plunk. plunk. We're going to modulate now, what? and Katie's going to play. Oh. <laughs> oh, I didn't have to modulate. Go back to C. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ready? W I when I go to the second goes. chord, you can play those two notes. Ready? Uh, uh, on the two? first chord, you can play all four notes. Ready? A one. Here's Katie's big uh, solo. A one, two, three, and. Working on the railroad just to pass the time away. Can't you hear the whistle blowing? <laughs> Arise up so early in the morn. Shout in, die to blow your horn. I have to find a horn, just a minute. I know there's one on here. Well, how, about a, how about a bell? A bell? Yeah. No. Oops. Get yours, Whoops. get yours. That's sleigh bells. More. 
All right. Well, that now was... that's the kind of entertainment you can't get on. Uh, now you know. <laughs> <laughs> or even that Star Wars girl. So, so they started May Day for Labor Day. Yes, they did. And the railroad did it? And it spread around the world, but, but people in the United States have forgotten it. and, and But we haven't. That's why Will doesn't forget we're doing any... this show from beginning to end. Whether it makes sense or not, whether there's a stupid song that really doesn't fit in there or not, we're just going to keep going from beginning to end. And our crew of one has the day off and will not have to edit out anything. All right. And yeah. it's in honor of our labor because we push the button on the camera ourselves. That's right. That's right. We hope this is recording. That's a snap. Uh, you pushed the button, didn't you? Yeah. You did? Yeah. Oh, good. The, the, <laughs> yeah. Hey. The right button? Speaking of labor. The right button? I hope so. The right button? Me too. The right brothers? It's, it's, I, gotta, I gotta leave. Yeah. I wanna tell you something. <laughs> That's right, that did not come out of your mouth. Okay, no. go ahead. Mm -mm. So, speaking of labor, why don't you tell the folks what your first job ever was? My first job? Yeah, do you remember your first job? You mean first paid job? Paid, yeah, something you get paid for. Cause hmm. that's, not I not guess counting it's, your parents paying you to um, babysit. Babysit, or you know, well, babysitting counts. was probably you know for other people was probably my first. No, no, a uh, paper route. You had a paper route? Oh sure. What yeah. paper? Cleveland Press. Really? Yeah. Did yeah. you have a bike? It was a Scripps Howard uh, uh, paper, like the Philadelphia Press was a Scripps Howard, or uh, the the Pittsburgh Press. Was. How often did you deliver the paper? Every day. Really? Seven days a week. Did you, after school or before school? Or as school? I used to like to say, 24-7. That's the kind of um, anachronism that would show up in a movie nowadays, people saying 24-7 back in the 60s or 70s well, or something. They say when no it one now. said that. They say it now, but nobody said it then. Um, <clears throat> let's see. Uh, what was the question? Uh, yeah, you seven days a week, uh, which included, uh, no, we got the Cleveland Press, which was the labor paper, and uh, I, I, uh, I delivered the Cleveland, uh, the plain. It was called the Cleveland Plain Dealer then. Now it's just called the Plain Dealer, Ohio's largest weekly, but it was the Cleveland Plain Dealer, one of uh, seven newspapers, daily newspapers that used to be in Cleveland, and by the time. Uh, I was delivering papers. It was down to two or three. I think the Cleveland News had closed earlier, but yes. How? Uh, when did you do it? Before school or after school? Well, that's the trouble. I queried. Yes, you did. Yes. And uh, and I responded as uh, thusly. I should say, uh, I responded thusly. Mornings, cruel mornings when it's freezing cold outside. I'm out there with my bicycle which didn't have any gears, you know. Uh, it has multiple gears, it was just a bicycle. <laughs> yeah, that's cruel. that's cruel winters. <sighs> when icicles hang by the wall. And, um, uh, hey, when it gets to be winter, I could sing some of my Christmas songs. Okay, Including that Irving Icicle. <laughs> and, <laughs> well, that sounds like fun. Yeah, oh, it's a great song. I, yeah. I babysat. You know what else I did when I was when I was little? Bef Want to know? Um, oh yes. What was your first job? Um, Tell you later. Great. <laughs> oh wait, that's the end. Well, we have to we have to give the credits now. We have to give the credits. Oh. Um, this is uh, this show is. Uh, Copyright, uh, Will Ryan and Vocal Inc. And uh, we'd like to thank all of our patrons. Yes, thank you, everybody, for supporting us on Patreon. And if you're thinking about it, don't think anymore. Just do it. Because, yeah. yes, we really appreciate it. Right. And we have a social advisor. Yes, Bethany Valero. And... Um, our crew of one, who yes. we can shout him out even though he's not working on this one. Right. Right, Vinny J. Vinny J. 
Awesome hey, hey, sauce. Vinny J. Hey, yeah. hey, 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 we could write a hey, song. Hey, real big boy. Hey, Vinny J. Yeah, <laughs> hey, that's good. <laughs> Who else is in our credits? Martin! <laughs> and the music. Which... I was just thinking of, I was uh, thinking of Joe Alasky the other day. Uh, he was so good. He was so good. He could do all of the Mel Blanc characters. And he did a perfect Jackie Gleason. And he was selected by Jackie Gleason a couple of times to, no to do Jackie's voice. Well, I'm not sure if we're going to have music on this show, but if we do have music on the oh, credits, no, I got Wait no, out. I'm Everything doing... is written by Will Ryan. Let's see. Uh, I'll, I'll see. Um, uh, I like to play Sudoku. <laughs> I like to play Sudoku. Yes, I do. I like to play. It's a weird song because it drops beats all over the place. You gotta, you gotta hear it. You Someday... have to fill in the blanks. <laughs> <laughs> yes, like a crossword puzzle. <laughs> <laughs> like so, Sudoku. Yeah. And so it's the end of the show, so I guess we should hit the chimes again. Okay. And we should let you see the chimes. We have real chimes. Yeah. Go ahead, I'll hold it. We got it. these for the show, and you'll start seeing I'll hold them it, soon and you can in hit upcoming it. episodes. Ready? Yep. <clears throat> we don't know what this melody means, but it's the theme melody for Tell You Later, and it goes like this. <laughs> okay, one what? more time. Huh? Why is it doing that? I don't know. Because I'm holding it, probably. Here we go. Yeah. Goodbye. <laughs>